What's going on here? Ladies and gentlemen, we got Mr. Frost coming to you with a video. It's been a little bit, I understand, and I'm sorry about that. I had to get some stuff taken care of, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. Right now, you can see I'm rocking my Savage Pendant. This is that white gold over the sterling. I've had this piece for a very long time. Do a quick little shine test for you so you guys can see it. Even though this video is not about it. Man, it shines, you know, it dances. It's a nice little piece. I like this piece. It's a good piece. But we're not here for that today. I had people asking me about rope chains and some other things. Uh, watches, even rings, uh, stuff of that nature. Uh, after this video, I do have a pendant uh, video coming on that I got custom made from a jeweler of mine in New York. Uh, no link to that, though. No link. I had to talk to him personally and figure all this shit out. But before we go ahead, y'all need to like, subscribe to these videos. And another thing, I got a bro, all right? This man's name is Romeo Brown. Look him up on YouTube. He does some ice style videos on some fire shit, on some real talk. He's got some drip too. We drip. Everybody drip. So it's a good shout out to the community, man. Everybody help everybody. But without further ado, you ladies and gentlemen, you wanted the video, I'm going to bring it to you. Mr. Frost style. All right, everybody. Now, I don't know. I can't do the pause thing, and I'm sorry about that. But we have some special things for you today in store. Now, we have people asking about the rope chains and how, you know, they may look like crap or so on and so forth. Well, first off, we're going to show you this rope chain. I'm a construction worker. Don't mind my hands. I got this. This is a solid... 925 sterling silver rope chain in the four millimeter. Now, this is a beautiful piece. I mean, rope chains are good. You can hang a pendant on them. You can rock them every day. You can rock two, three of them, different sizes, different thicknesses. They're just an all around nice piece. You know, they don't really kink that well on it. You know, they don't, you know, you can just, it's always good. Bam. It's always just a good chain. I rocked these since I was a kid, you know, one of my first chains was a rope chain, and they've been a staple in the jewelry community ever since, whether they're iced out or not, they don't have to be iced to be drippy, they're shiny, I mean, it shines, you know, it's a nice shiny, this hasn't even been polished in a minute either, and it's still nice and shiny, not like no stones though, but... So, we got the silver rope chain. Now, this is, uh, I wear this constantly. But, if you guys are looking for something, and I had a lovely lady ask me, uh, personally if, you know, she was like, my husband got a birthday coming up. Well, I was thinking about getting him a chain. And a rope chain, you know, something out of that nature. And, I 100% agree with that. You should definitely get your man a chain. Men, you should get your woman a chain. You can get whatever they want. But rope chains are seriously gorgeous. Now, me personally, this is from Harlem Bling. Y'all know him. Y'all love him. That's the main man right there. He's the shit. 925 Italian Sterling. 925 Italian Silver on eBay. Sorry about that. But also, HarlemBling.com. I have a card in the bags. You've seen that multiple times. I don't need to bring that out again. But what I have gotten from them is now my favorite piece. This is my 18 karat rose gold over sterling. This is a five millimeter rope chain. And the rose gold, as you can tell, it's a lot bigger, a little thicker than the, uh, than the silver one we got there. But they're beautiful. And I got them in two different lengths. So, you know, you can imagine, you know, they sit real nice on each other. They sit good. They sit flush on the neck. They sit nice. They don't tangle with each other. They never fight. They don't fight. They just go. They just keep you looking fresh. And for anybody out there looking for a rope chain, I suggest you get a rope chain. Francos are nice. You know, Cubans are nice. <coughs> Sorry. 
Cubans are nice. Francos, you know, you got the box links. You got, you got all these crazy, you know, Byzantine and all them types of chains. But at the end of the day, the classic chain is the rope chain. No doubt about it. 100% of and I'm going to tell you, every day wear, it's a good piece. It looks nice if you're going out to eat, you're going to a wedding, you, you're doing you. You want to go to the movies, you rock this. You want to go to KFC, get yourself a fucking 20 piece and some biscuits, you rock this. Because this is what we do up in New York. They always have them nice chains. But we're going to go into a little more special. Special? Wow, sorry. A little big deer, guys. Some special shit for you. So I hope you all like them rope chains. And I highly suggest purchasing some rope chains on your, you know, whatever you guys want, whether it's from Harlem Bling, which I highly suggest his rope chains are flawless. I've never had a problem with any of his chains in general. But just like my boy, Romeo Brown, shout out to my man right there. He's the man, the myth, the legend. He's the drip God. He dripping so hard. You can swear it's raining everywhere he walks. But that don't mean that NY dripping ain't got no drip. You know what I'm talking about? So, this is one of my favorite pieces. This is an 18 karat gold. With the VVS. One. Clarity. Stones all up in this motherfucker. And now this bitch shines. I don't even have light on it. And it shines. And this is Miami Cuban Link. Miami Cuban Link. It's a beautiful chain. I'm gonna got that iced out. I already know y'all want to see that shine test, so we're gonna have to put that shine test on for you. And I mean, phew, hope y'all brought sunglasses, cause I mean this shit, this shit dances, dancing in the moonlight, in the sun, no matter. It's a good chain. This this is my. I wear this. I actually was wearing this today and got a couple, two, three compliments on this piece. It's just a beautiful chain all around. 100%. Gorgeous chain. Show you, you know, you got that nice little click right here. Ain't coming off. Nobody's snatching that shit off your neck. That's a beautiful piece right there. I know y'all like it because I like it. Now, we got a little something something for y'all, y'all people who need something on the fingers. Because, you know, why wear all this shit if you ain't going to set it up? Now, you can wear just certain things. I, you know, I ain't wrong on that shit. You can do that whatever you want. But I'm saying, why not have a nice little 18 karat with the iced out? It's got to be a thing. Last time I checked, about over 80 stones in this just on the front. Looks good. You know, it's just a nice ring overall. It's got all the markings inside. It's a beautiful piece. So you've seen some Cubans. You've seen some rope chains. Just some of the stuff I have that I rock. But we're going to go out on some shit. And we're going to go out on top. Now this is coming out of my personal collection. Well shit, it's all my personal collection. But... I don't break these out often because these are my top pieces. But for you guys, I'll do it. Okay? We're going to break out. We're going to break it out. Oh, let me grab it. I'm sorry. It's over here. Okay. Oh. We're just going to set this around and move the entire thing over. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Now, without further ado... Wow, I know, your jaw just hit the motherfucking floor, these are my customs, this is the gold nugget style, 18 karat yellow gold, with them pointers for each hour on the hour, because we always take time by the hour, not the minute. And then we got the rose gold and the full flooded. This was actually my first piece right here, actually, to be honest with you. This one came later. I'll even slap it on for you real quick. Beautiful piece, guys. I mean, watches bring bring everything together. And, you know, everyone, you know, they use their phone now and shit. 
to check their time. First, it started out as a stopwatch. Now it's just a dying breed. But I'm going to tell you right now, this thing snaps. People be like, oh, what time is it? And they got their phone on them. Motherfuckers asking me what time it is and they got a watch on. Just anything to get close to that ice. So I showed you a little bit of treats. You got some upcoming stuff coming around. We got rope chains. We got watches. We got ropes. We got rings. We got... I missed that shit. I'm sorry. We got rings. We got more rope chains. Like, I'll make it a rain, a rope chain for you. Because y'all people want to make it rain rope. Like, we'll make it rain. Like, oh, make it rain. We make it rain ice. We make it rain jewelry. Doesn't matter what it is. Pendants, rings, whatever. NY Dripping got you covered. You personally want to hit me up? You can hit me up at Vinny Demore at me.com. Or, yeah, right. It's a little bait right there. Little Demore at me.com, yeah. That's my personal link. If you have any questions about Harlem Bling or anything, hit me up. You know, that's my personal shit, so don't be doing some stupid shit. But if you have honest questions or something about that nature, feel free to even comment. I answer all comments. I will get back to you. Personally send you a reply. You do you, all right? But I will personally try to help you guide your beautiful experience when it comes to that beautiful drip, all right? Switch this back around real quick. Yikes. Oh, people. You know, it's just, I got you. Oh, my whole thing just fell. What do you look at that? Well, there's some more realism for you. Whole thing just fell up on this shit. And that was my bad. There you go. Just, we'll throw this on just for you guys. Real quick. Before we end it out. So you can see it. Because I know you want to see it. I'm mean, shit, I want to see it. And I wear it all the time. That quick snap. Shit says good. This is your boy NY dripping, as you already can tell. Coming at you with some real shit. I talk to you. I don't tell you what to buy. I don't care what you buy. As long as you buy it. You do you. Don't let anybody tell you that you can't do it. I got shit all the time. Oh, you're white. You can't wear ice. <laughs> like Lil Wayne said, black or white diamonds. Fuck segregation. That's some real shit right there. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if you're from Cali. I don't care if you're from Alaska. I don't care if you're from Russia. If you want to drip, call in a thunderstorm. You do you. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. This has been NY Dripping. This is your boy, Mr. Frost. Get a hold of me. Leave some comments. Like, comment, subscribe. We'll get some shit going. And another shout out to my boy, Romeo Brown. Because go look at this shit. I'm telling you right now, you're going to look at this video and be like, shit, wow, now I got to go do it. And you're going to switch over and you're going to do it because I fucking told you to do it. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yeah, video's still going. You can like pause it and just dip the fuck out. Do you. On some real shit, yo, it's NY dripping. You already know how we keep it. We keep it flowing. We keep it crispy. We keep it icy. Y'all keep it real right now. I love y'all. Keep it real. From the East Coast. Peace.